bleed over here internally for a while. Here, it's a super fun way to pass the time. Yeah, yeah, don't mind me. Just a guy who hired ya. Sorry, am I being passive aggressive? My bad. That must be a symptom of all. Holy crap! You saved my life. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry. Heart's bounding. Never been shot at before. Kind of fun, actually. Look, these crazy bastards at Todd Kilio Station right after I sent for you guys. If we can drive them off, we'll be free to go after that vault on the moon's surface. All right, looks like you got a shield. Pretty self-explanatory, really. It leads bullets until it depletes. When it does, you gotta hide and give it time to recharge. Hey, just let me activate the defense controls. A few seconds, we'll have turrets, force fields, laser wires. <laughs> these assholes won't know what hit them. Critical failure. Helios defense systems are being jammed. What? How? Jamming signal originates from Elpis. Pandora's moving. Oh crap. Kill the turrets. Kill the turrets! to evacuate. Escape ships are this way. We must take this ground. Who's that drama queen? I don't know, she leads these jackasses, I think? I don't know, but the first person to shoot her in the head gets a high five from the Turbo Mansion. Alright, let me get to this door. The escape ships are nearby. She destroyed the ships. We gotta find another way out the station. What was that alien looking thing? Uh, no idea, but I get the feeling it could kill us with its brain, so you know, uh, <laughs> keep running. Jack, what the hell is going on? I'm getting reports of alarms all across Helios. Nothing, sir. Nothing. Everything's fine. Just, uh, one of the claptrap units tried to prevent the light socket, sir. Need I remind you? that you are there to observe, Pandora. Nothing more. If you incur any damages to the Helios space station, I will personally... Ah, oh, sorry, sir, we're losing connection. I can uh, What? I called you an asshole because I thought I'd hung up. My bad. We will speak again, John. There's Elpis. That friggin' jamming signal is somewhere down on that cracked rock messing up all the cool security stuff up here. Son of a taint! Hey, why the hell are you attacking us, you dicks? I want this station and I want to save the universe. What the hell is supposed to be? You can't hope to win! Right now! 
lunatics! What are these maniacs doing? We don't even have a real military up here. They're just murdering workers and us if we don't move it. Okay, well, I've got a stupid idea. We're gonna head to that moon. Cannon, follow me. So, what are we doing? Something with a cannon? Basically, a huge gun that shoots supplies down to the moon's surface, like at about a thousand miles an hour. We're gonna get in one of those containers and escape that way. Is that safe? I don't know. Be a pretty cool way to die, though, huh? I had suspicions. Money, revenge, that said, whoever needed a reason out here. Oh! 
that guy really likes fire. Elevators the over there. The Let's go. Run. This is kind of exciting. Yeah. Our story just began with us getting off a bus. This sounds all explosive and stuff. Stop complimenting the prisoner. We can get in the moonshot up there. Let me get the elevator. Damn it, something's jamming the elevator up there. Figure something out. All right, weird idea. Uh, let me work the loading terminal. No problem. I'm real good at not falling off stuff. Let's get moving. Hold on, I'm gonna spin the cylinder. Make it up there? Free up the elevator so I can join you. Got waist in tight. <clears throat> no big deal though, they can't feel pain. Just bash them out of there. <laughs> oh, these loaders bum me out. It's no wonder Dahl took us over so easily. I need more soldiers. Badasses, like you. Woo, we made it. All right, we just gotta get into a moonshot container. Kill this asshole! The moon is ours, sir. Come on! Come on! The moon is ours, Colonel! Alright, that's twice you saved my life. Uh, now we just gotta... Oh, for what the... The auto shock controls are damaged! Someone's gotta stay back and launch the pods manually. Uh, I'd suggest Wilhelm, but I need you there on Elpis cracking skulls. What was that? I wasn't listening. Alright, new plan. I'll stay behind. I need you down on the moon. You gotta find that jamming signal and shut it down. Otherwise, we'll never get control of the moon base and we can kiss that vault goodbye. You really gonna stay? I better get paid if you bite it. Now nah, you saved my life a couple of times, I'm repaying the favor. Besides, I'm a hero, baby. Self-sacrifice is part of the job. Oh, good, a health machine. I had one put in here after a worker had an accident and uh, lost his torso. Better heal up before your trip down to the moon. <laughs> Might want to grab some ammo too. Supplies over here. We need to get a moonshot container up here. Normally we'd load some supplies, but this time you're the cargo. Okay, this container ought to do the trick. Container's already cool. I'm closing the container. Watch your limbs. Loading you into the delivery chamber. This is gonna be loud. It's slightly awesome. You're telling me Jack, the handsome Jack, the guy who murdered my boyfriend, stayed behind while you escaped? Like hell. Whether his decision was heroic or purely strategic, I can't say. But if Jack hadn't stayed behind to reject the pod, I might well have died on Helios. <laughs> Your story is making handsome Jack kind of sympathetic. I hate it. All right, we're ready to fire. Whenever you're ready, I'll shoot you to Concordia. It's the biggest town on Elpis. I know someone there who can help you find that jamming signal.
might be salvage. You're about to die. You okay? Well, I can answer that. You're not okay. The second you open this door, all the oxygen is going to vent and you're going to suffocate. It'll hurt a lot and your eyes will pop like grapes when the pressure differential gets too harsh. So, here's my plan. When you're ready, open the door and follow me to my oxygen bubble. Sound good? Don't answer. Conserve your oxygen. Way. Don't think about the grapes thing. Nice to meet ya. I'm Janie Springs, junk dealer. Who are you? Wilhelm. I like your cybernetic eye. And beard. So what are you doing here? Trying to get back to Helios. There's a jamming signal around here we gotta take care of first, though. A jamming signal? Haven't noticed anything like that. You might want to get to Concordia. A little city run by a fella called the Merith. Gotta be somebody there who can help you. You'll need an O2 kit. Oz kits, we call them, to survive the journey, though. I've got some broken ones stashed nearby, but I can repair them for you. Even if you ain't the breathing type, you'll be glad you've got an Oz kit. Head to these coordinates and clear the place out. One piece and not lava adjacent. Kill the crack in the enemy.
Ah, oh, I forgot I locked it. Whoops. Just punch off the locks with your meat hunks. That's moon for hands. <laughs> for me too. Not excited about being mauled again. jumping and slamming enemies. Now, to repay me for saving your life, you're gonna end someone else's. His name's Deadlift, he's nearby and he's an asshole. He's also got something I'll need to get us into Concordia. Deadlift leads a band of scavengers, scavs. I Wait. Her name's Zarpadon. Hey, I got bored one day and started writing children's books, but I lost them. Can you find them for me? You could totes give me some feedback too. deep and greedy and crap. Moon cracked open, people died, no one lived happily ever after. Finn, what do you think? Not enough pictures. I'll take it under advisement. I think there might be another one in my old camp. It got overrun by crag and it's killed my... They killed it. named Flamey, who jumped out of the crack and bit Janie. She blew off its face, now there's no trace of the Kraken who dared such cockamamie. Well? Pretty cool. Fair enough. Good feedback. Oh, that reminds me though, Flamey's son owes me a life and he's still out there. Track him down and get it for me, yeah?
this one is called Baby Kragen Goes on an Adventure. Baby Kragen crawled out of the crack with his mum, Flamey. They saw strange two-legged creatures and thought they must be food. So Baby Kragen and his mum raided the camp. Flamey tore a two-legger up pretty bad and Baby Kragen killed another one. Then Baby Kragen ran away like a little <laughs> stupid piece of shit. That one must be corrupted or something, I don't know. Bring those back while I write another one about how you killed an evil fire monster. Uh Some publishers are interested. But only if I cut out the parts where people and baby kragans die. I was like, nah. at the apex of your jump, I just need you to get airborne and say something inspirational. Uh. Sorry, say something inspirational, y'all. No. All right, cool. This time, I'll throw up a couple of targets. Try to shoot them before you land and it'll make for an even better poster. And say something inspirational again. No. Finale time. Get into the air, then slam down on that pressure pad by crouching. Then say something cool and look as badass as possible. No. All right, that was cool. Now turn on the printer and it should spit out your posters. Lovely stuff. Come on back. There was no film in the cameras. Just kidding. Joke. Don't freak out. Deadlift, that guy. Just ordered a bunch of inspirational posters. I have motivational issues. Head to his ship and put them up everywhere. Here, take the posters and the delivery confirmation. I need you to get that delivery confirmation signed before you put the posters up. Reserves at 50. 
50%. So, why is this deadlift guy gonna die? He's kind of a dick. <laughs> All right. Well, he also stole my Moonzumi Digistract keys, stranded me out here, and got really rude when I told him I wasn't into guys. But mainly the being a dick thing. Colonel Zarpadon. <laughs> you must leave Elvis. Things are about to get much worse. I don't want to kill you if I don't have to. Eh, got paid to kill you. Better do it. Fine. Do it you will. This is Colonel Zarpadon. I need you to kill the Vault Hunters headed for your ship. Get them, sir. I ain't taking orders from the chick who threw me in prison. They said your jump pads are stupid. I will annihilate them! Package. Sign for it or I'll kill you. I would be delighted. Great. Now give him the package. Thanks. Now get out of my sight. He's got the package? Cool. Now kill him. Guy's an asshole. What is this? What secrets do you hold? Awesome. <laughs> now you just have to put the posters up all around the ship. Deadlift's men will try to kill you the entire time, but...
they're going to get what they paid for, even if you shoot them in the sternums while they get it. Seen a smile today. She got creepy. She got back from a recon around 0300. Said she had a good lead on this Jess chick she'd been looking for. That's kind of running at her. This, but that she wouldn't stop talking. All excited. Said they were sisters or something. Said she'd been looking for since she was a kid. Said that they escaped that door together once she found her. Like I said, nice enough. Don't screw her over or I'll be pissed. and see what the damage is. Warning. Oxygen levels at 50% and dropping. Don't let those hoity-toity Hyperion goons take one more step. those two live wires, it should reactivate the jump pad. Just stand between the two sparky bits. Sounds dangerous. Yep, gonna hurt lots. Right, now just go kill the guy so you can get to Concordia. Why are those Hyperion screwbags still alive? <laughs> Thank you. 
ride jump pads? I never got to ride a jump pad. I also witnessed the deaths of many innocent people. Jump pads, though. Just use dumbass and I can get you close to Concordia and find that signal. Those vault hunters die today, or my name isn't Bucephalus Deadlift McElroy. Come on, let me try! Deadlift, not suffer. Zapperin couldn't stop me! <laughs> yeah, steal my battery! zoomies at the Dahl way station. Get yourself there, but be careful. Scavs have taken over that place after the Krakening. So tough. Warning zero atmosphere environment. Those 
these oxygen geysers will refill your Oz kit. Just step into one and take a deep whiff. Testament of Tom Thorson, doll captain. Deadlift scabs are boarding my ship as I speak. Whoever finds this echo, please find it in your heart to honor a doomed man's last wishes. Just press the next message button when you're ready. Better get paid at the end of this. Thanks. First off, I need you to inform Colonel Zarpadon of my death. Plug this echo recorder into a transmitter and convey the message. Dahl colony way back. But then the crackening happened. Lava erupting everywhere had them buggering off pretty quick. They left whole factories here to rot. Equipment just lying around. After a few years, the first fleet arrived. It wasn't the first one here, but that's what they called it. People started living here again. Maybe living is an overstatement, but people are here, amongst everything else. No one really knows why the crackening happened. But most people you run into will say Dahl caused it, extracting minerals or something, I don't know. I guess stories don't have to be true to be believed, they just have to be told. And I tell that one a lot.
you for informing me of Captain Thorson's fate, Vault Hunter. Though you will not have my mercy, you do have my respect. What you told the Colonel of my death, I'd like you to avenge me. It looks like Squad, Deadlift's Lieutenant, is boarding my ship right now. If you could track him Don't down and kill him, myself. I'd appreciate it. Dick. No! That's that. Sorry I can't give you a reward, but, you know, I'm dead. Still, thanks. Vault Hunter, I want to thank you for fulfilling Captain Thorson's last wishes. Head to the following coordinates. stash months ago. You can have them until I take them back. something that'll get you into Concordia. Maybe you can find your signal there and get back to your ruddy huge space station. Hey, you survived! That was me high-fiving myself. 
They're looking for me, so I gotta go radio silent. Find the jamming signal, shut it down, and return to Helios. Well, hell, what are you doing on the outer planets? I thought you made all your money doing security work on the inner world.